In 1971, a gruesome killer known for dumping his victims on the side of the freeway haunted the streets of Washington, D.C. Inside the coat pocket of one of his victims was a note which read, I will admit to the others when you catch me, if you can. Freeway Phantom. The author of this note left six girls dead and has mystified authorities for decades. But there are still some clues and hints as to who the culprit may be. Carol Denise Spink. On April 25th, 1971, a 13-year-old girl named Carol Denise Spinks lived in the Congress Heights in DC and was sent to the local 7-Eleven by her older sister Valerie to pick up some TV dinners and as a reward, get herself a can of soda too. During her trip, she was spotted by her mother, Alentine, who was not impressed that her sister had sent her to the store by herself. She told her to pick up the errands and get back home, but she never did. It was only a short distance between the 7-Eleven and her home, but something happened on the short walk that has baffled investigators ever since. When her family realized she was missing, they went to the police, however, this was 1971, long before the days of Amber Alerts, and when a child went missing, there was no immediate investigation.